the COVID-19 cases here in our country, our government imposed an extensive lockdown that has broadly affected the lives of people. More than millions of Filipinos lost their jobs and are forced to stay at home. Due to a thorough study recently, experts have been able to propose a vaccine against the severe effects of COVID-19. This will serve as the protection of the people and allow them to come out without any doubt about the possible consequences that they may encounter if they caught this virus. As a result, people are gradually being vaccinated, even young people at the age 12 and above. On the other hand, double precautions are required for those who have not been vaccinated because if they cough this virus, they would suffer severely and can even lead to death. However, let us not be complacent and follow the protocols that have been implemented. protocols. Always wear your face mask and avoid going to crowded places. Practice physical distancing. Disinfect your surface and efficiently touch objects. Cover your mouth when you cough or sneeze with your elbow or a tissue then show that tissue in the dustbin. Wash your hands upon up soap and water for at least 20 seconds. Stay at home if you are feeling sick and avoid close contact with people. The DepEd has proposed the progressive expansion of limited face-to-face -face classes. We will seek input from other agencies as well as students' parents before allowing in-person classes in more schools. Education Secretary Leonor Bionis also recommended that the expansion is start no earlier than the first week of the program. In order for students to continue learning despite the crisis that we are facing right now, the Department of Education has decided to implement blended learning where they can learn through online or modular. human health, animal health, and environment. A collaborative multisectoral and transdisciplinary approach working at local, regional, national, and global level. The student which can be a part of the goal of One Health, which is to achieve optimal health outcomes recognizing the interconnection between people, animals, plants, and their shared environment by working with our family, friends, and community in taking care of our animals, planting in our backyard, and all recycling Even sharing one health awareness to the young ones, shared things we learn from our different subjects we learn from each We support one health!